Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Mario Party 2. Um, we are not doing so well, but the game has barely just begun. So let's see if we can pick up our lead. Alright, let's see who's gonna get hit by uh, Bowser's coin beam. Energy charge 300%. Fire the Bo Bowser coin beam now! Oh, no sign of life. No sign of life? I remember this. If any of you watching this has, have seen some of my, uh, Paper Mario, Paper Mario LP, you'd know that I gave Bowser a black voice for some reason, I have no idea, like, an extremely gangster black voice. <laughs> Alright, let's see. And our next game is Totem Pole Pound. I'm usually pretty darn good at this game. So basically you want to hip drop the totem bros into the ground, which is the A and Z button, or in my case, the A and L button. Another simple game. Just keep pounding. That's what she said. Okay, I would, I would really like to know if uh, Charles Martinet did did Luigi's voice for Mario Party 2 because it sounds way high pitched compared to what it is now. Like in the in the first in the first um, two Mario Party games, that was his the voice that we're hearing for Luigi now was his voice. And then, starting with Mario Party 3 onwards, with subsequent games, it started to get lower and lower and deeper. What we hear, what we hear today. So I wonder if that was Charles Martinet who did this voice for Luigi. Like, did they um, did they use some kind of equipment to alter their voice, like? voice actors often do. Although, although Mario's voice, he's able to produce naturally, which is freaking awesome, because I've seen a couple interviews, and we're all being chased down. I've seen a couple interviews, um, with Charles Mart Martinet, where he uh, impersonated Mario, and it was totally awesome. It's like, oh my god, I totally, I totally like geeked out. Like, oh my god, it's Mario. All right, looks like I'm going to be playing the item game, and I'm going to try and get the golden mushroom. Will I get it? Who knows. The main thing about this game is to raise the hammer as high as you can. Not too high, but... And I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong freaking button. Wow, that, that, that's incredible. Alright, our next game is Bombs Away. Now, nobody can really lose at this game. I mean, you can lose, but, you know, there isn't one winner. There can be, everybody can win, pretty much. You just have to stay alive, run around using the control stick and the A button to jump, and avoid the bombs that are coming at you from Bowser's ship. And all you have to do is last the time limit. Holy crap, really? That was an epic moment if I ever saw one. Seriously, 
That was awesome. I'm not even joking. Alright, what time are we at? We are at five minutes. Okay, we can, we can do quite a few more turns. I still can't believe I messed up that that item game. <laughs> that 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 was just hilarious. I may not have been laughing outwardly, but I was laughing on the inside, trust me. Because I was like just in utter shock that it even happened. <laughs> Damn, I wanted that golden mushroom though. Oh well, if I come across an item shop, I can just buy one. No big deal. Alright, seven steps for me. Hey, it looks like I might get another. Yep, I get another shot. Okay, let's see if I can hit the correct button this time. I had to look at my controller to make sure. Yes, warp block. Uh, I wanted the golden mushroom, but the warp block works just as well. Which means if anybody's close to the star, that means hopefully I can trade places with them. And our next game is Tipsy Tourney. Now, uh, the main mechanic of this game is to uh, move around and uncover the picture. Yeah, I'm not going to bother reading the rules because, you know, why would I do that when I can give just a quick description? And I, I, I kind of screwed up there. Oh, no, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on, you can do it, you can do it. Did I do it, did I do it? Yes! I did it. Thank you. Oh, Jesus, thank you, Lord. Thank you. Okay. Seven minutes. Okay, we can still go more. And DK gets chased by the Thwomp Criminal. I don't even know what that guy's name is. All I know is he's a criminal that the Sniffet Patrol is after. Haha, <laughs> you lost your coins, three of them. Alright. One, two, three. Oh god. For a second there I thought I was gonna land on that um Bowser space. Okay, lights out. The um object for the Player with the hammer is to obviously knock the crap out of his opponents, and the opponents with the light bulbs need to just run away and not get hit. And I am one of the light bulb carriers, so I have to run! Run for my life! Oh god. Um, okay, I don't. Okay. Why is he swinging just in the center? Okay, where where is he? Okay. Oh, Jesus. Four, three, two, one, and game over. We won. And Mario's over there just like Dude. <laughs> that was nice with the with the bombs away game how I just how it just blasted everyone off like the first or second bomb I can't even remember I think it was the first bomb Why would you go toward Baby Bowser? Uh, excuse 
me, I burped. My turn. Oh, that is awesome. Yes, it's a star. Awesome. Awesome. Alright, one of my favorite games, Hexagon Heat. Now, the main thing for this game is to run to the hexagon that matches the color of the fly I raise. Last one standing wins. That was a nice short explanation. So, pay attention to the color and move. Um, Yoshi's in a. Okay, Yoshi is dead. Okay, stay on the white one. Run to the red one. And it's just down to me and DK. Oh god! Yes! I think I think that little um miss jump kind of paid off there, because DK bopped me on the head and went backward. Alright, one more turn and that'll be the end of this video. Yay, and who's he gonna steal from? Me, of course, because I'm the leader. And how many did he steal? 22, damn. Ha! Hopefully he loses them. Or with my luck, it'll be a Bowser Revolution or something. No, not Bowser's Coin Pop luck. That's that's just as bad. Okay, it's only ten coins. Oh well. But shit, that leaves me with only thirty-nine. Coins. I think he said 30 coins in the bank. And I'm about to get stolen from again. Wait, does Donkey Kong get. Bleh. Did, did Donkey Kong get a star? I can't even remember. Facing off against DK in a one versus three mini game, and our mini game is bowl over. So basically, we're um, bowling pins, and he has to try and knock us over. But we can uh, move out of the way by moving the control stick and pressing A. That was, um, a horrible attempt. But anyway, guys, that'll be it for this episode of Let's Play Mario Party 2. I am the Super Saiyan 4 Gamer. As always, like, comment, subscribe, and tell other people about me on YouTube. Later.